Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. Kira, don't you want inside at all? What are you looking at? Oh, she's watching you. Do you want inside? Oh, no. No, she just wants Memphis. Maybe now. Come on. Come on, let's go inside. So Kira's been coming inside for Dan, but uh, I think you've been here in many days. She now knows who you are and you're no longer important. Yeah, my excitement period. Warm. Yep. Oh, we got closer. You wanna come in? Oh, good stretch. Look at you in that. <laughs> so if I come over here, if I come over here, that's what I thought. Fine, you can stay out here for a little while longer. Look at you all comfortable now that you're finally back in the house. All right, we got the dogs back in the house. Dan and I are actually getting ready to go do a dog transport, which you're gonna see a little bit of that on today's video, but we're also gonna do a more in-depth video on that over at youtube.com slash gone to the snow dogs, uh, probably next week sometime. So anyway, you be good, you be good. Stay here with daddy and uh, Dan and I are gonna go save some huskies. Oh, you look just like my girl. Guess what we're doing today, guys? <laughs> I already forgot what your name was. Roscoe and something else. Kalua. This is what Jess looks like when she's operating a vehicle. Hey, Grandma, get off the wheel. <laughs> it is beautiful out here, oh my gosh. And it's cold again. It's chilly. It's brisk. Yeah. I don't even know what that means. It feels like fall. Yeah, yeah. It feels like fall. Yeah. We got stowaways in the back. We do. We have two of them. We have Roscoe. That's such a cool name. It is, huh? And Kalula. Hey. Hi, there you go. <laughs> Boo. Oh, you guys are so good. They, you know, they really have been good. Oh, till, oh yes. until now. Yes. Until we start Oh. Are you gonna sing us a song? They love the camera, that's what it is. It that was like and subscribe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're transporting them what, an hour and a half? Hour yeah. and a half down to the foster home that they're going to. Yes. They're gonna go live their best life instead of their life they were living. And they're such good dogs, they'll go right away. Yeah, yeah. If you're looking for a bonded pair of dogs, um, it's a male and a female, they, they'll both be fixed before they can get adopted. But. Holy cow, they're so good. Yeah. I've done a lot of transports. Like I've done I've done a lot of transports. These are probably two of the, the best behaved dogs I've ever transported. Yeah, I know you were super concerned. Yeah, I was. I was because you, you just never know what you're gonna get. You know, right. people lie. That's the worst part. People just lie and they they're like, oh they're the dogs are great, and then you get them and they're not. Of course. But these dogs have actually been amazing. Yeah, you look a lot less stressed out. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. it, even then yesterday, like knowing we had to do this today, yeah, I feel, yeah. And like I said, I feel like they're, they're gonna go, they're gonna get home to real fast. Yeah, and this beautiful view makes it a lot easier to drive too. Yeah. Holy cow. There's like no traffic at all. Look at, there's like three or four cars on the road. <laughs> are those rockets? <laughs> uh, no, those are silos. Everybody just has all this empty roads and all this empty land. There's nothing there. Well, yes, there is. There's little baby plants there. It looks like grass. How it's do you know? Grass. That's, I don't know. That could, ah, that should be taller if it's corn. That could be, no, that's corn. That's actually corn. You see the little splits up at the top of it. All I see is like. How do I know? I've lived here long <laughs> enough to know. <laughs> all I see is everything's like, needs to be like mowed. Like who mows this? Um, the farmers. I'll turn that into hay. Turn some of it. Some of it's wheat fields. You turn grass into hay. Well, no, it has to be hay to turn it into hay. Oh, okay. Hay looks like grass before it before it looks like hay. I'm just impressed with your ability to identify what's growing out there, even though it's all just green. Oh, you can thank Jamie for that. Yeah. Because I used to do the same thing. I don't know what any of this stuff was. Yeah. And then he started teaching me. Oh, if it's this, it's this. If it's that, it's that. He grew up in more farm country than I did. So I learned all that stuff from me. I usually don't see too many baby animals out here, but we saw baby horses. Yep. The deer out there looked like they were minish, like they were- Yeah, those were tiny deer that yeah. we saw. But it's just open. Why doesn't anybody live there? Because you gotta grow food. Where do you think your food comes from? <laughs> the store. <laughs> Where does it come from before that? <laughs> Costco. 
<laughs> I don't know. It comes from out there. That's corn. It's there's nothing there. How do you know it's gonna be corn? corn? It is. Oh. It's corn. I'm telling you. How do you know it's like that? Like pears or peaches? Because pears and peaches grow on trees. Oh. <laughs> you wouldn't plant them that close together. <laughs> there's purple stuff. Lilacs, yeah. Yeah, they're all over down here, and they're actually opening. They're not opening at our house yet. It's warmer down here. I've also noticed it's like motorcycles. Different tractor companies paint their tractors different. Yes. Like the orange ones are cool, and there's blue ones. Oh, I never yes. seen a blue one. We have the a blue one at the farm. That one's big. Oh, it's got one, two, three, four, five, six. It's got eight tires. It's a tractor tip and tractor, like from uh, cars. Oh yes. <laughs> See, now you're speaking my language. As soon as you turn it into the Cars movie or Pixar, yeah. I'm back. I am back in again. You're like, oh yeah, it does look just like that. Yeah. Our stowaways are being so good. Hi. That one's shaking his head at me. You have no idea what corn is. <laughs> <laughs> like this house has no fence. It's just there. Yeah. Well, that's really pretty, actually. It's, half a mile. Turn right it's so crazy right how much things are made out of brick. Yeah. Because we can have bricks in California because they all come falling down from the earthquakes. Right. But here, you There's can have brick things. stuff. I don't think this. I don't think is corn. I think this is. No, I lied. That's corn too. <laughs> it all looks the same. It, at the top of the plant, you can Take see the little. Right onto County Highway at oh, 24. You can see the like the tiny corn. Yeah, it's tiny. Corn. So right now, if I cut it down, I get the tiny corn. No, that's not. But if I let it grow, I get the bigger corn. Oh, it's just a plant. Oh hi. We're the ones. We're going to see you. Exactly. I'm gonna get rid of her. Hey, pretty boy. Where'd you go, rascal? Where are you going? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, yeah, they're good. I mean, they're they're good. I've done a lot of transports, and they're good. I mean, he's good on. So all they've ever done has been out on a leash like this. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. They don't know what life is yet. No. Nope. But they'll they find really out. They really don't. Yeah. Oh my gosh, check out all the cows. <gasps> Look, that one's dark as chocolate milk. They're looking at you too. They are. Like, are I you? speak cow. Moo! <laughs> Moo! Hi! Oh, that one right there wants a piece of me. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Wait, there's no fence. There's a fence. There's a fence. Wow, how come they don't just leave? Because they get fed there. They're chilling. I usually don't see them laying down. Hi, Indy. No, you gotta come out here. We gotta get out of the way. Come on, we gotta get out of the way over here. Come on, over here. We gotta get out of the way. We gotta get out of the way. We gotta get out of the way. Look, Dan's driving the four wheeler. Dan's never driven a four wheeler before. What's he doing, huh? What's he doing? Yeah, right? You got it? goodness so we made it back home a little while ago today was a long day that was a long drive went down and saved some puppies there'll be a full video going up on that over at a uh, gone to the snow dogs sometime this week or next week i think kira and i are just out here playing in the yard it's nice out huh say it's back down in the 60s it's not 80 like it was the other day huh what do you think you want to play oh you don't want to play anymore why well, was just playing with you i went to go get the camera so we could play we're fine, I guess. Be that way. But yeah, we made it back home. It was a long drive. It was fun. 
the dogs are safe. Um, the foster home, look at that pretty view. The foster home that we took them to sent me some videos and they are settling in just fine. They were really good dogs. If you guys are looking to adopt a bonded pair of Huskies from Michigan, oh my gosh, they were super, super well-behaved dogs. Like, probably the best well-behaved dogs I've ever transported, ever. I wonder if we can see. Eh, no sunset yet. Can we go play? Nope. You done playing? All right, let's go inside. And that's all we have for you guys today. Again, if you have not subscribed to Dan's channel, you can find him at youtube.com slash rfsdan. He does a weekly live interactive trivia game show, which is super fun. If you guys like trivia and live shows, you should check that out. And you can also find us both at youtube.com slash ccmousepodcast. What do you think, Memphis? Memphis says, it's time to go to bed, guys. We hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. We will see you again soon. Good night, partyants. If you love our huskies, come along for the ride. All you have to do is hit subscribe. Follow as we share our lives with our dogs and join our adventures on Snow Dog Vlogs.